mortal will heal my pain. Alright, welcome everyone, Christine here on Serious Gaming with a Total War Saga Troy playing as the Amazons, as Pen uh, uh, Penfacilia. Alright, normal difficulty, I think in this game particular higher difficulties just end up creating a huge mess where in the end game everyone has basically infinite resources and it completely destroys the diplomacy of the game and the economy of the game. So I think until they patch that out, playing on uh, playing on a high difficulty just doesn't work. At least in terms of campaign difficulty, it's just pretty broken. Anyway, so the Amazons have to rank up their units in order to get higher quality units. It's a, well, reminds me of the Blade Banner Lord and some other people have made that comparison. Uh, then they have Blood Oath. So if you have high battle glory, you gain campaign and battle bonuses and unlock and upgrade your blood elf to be able to summon powerful blood sworn units. But you can't get reinforcements in battle. So you can have multiple armies. You don't have supply lines as her, but you can't have an army reinforce another. So that's going to be a bit of an issue, I feel. And, and she is the daughter of Ares, so she gets... 10% uh, favor with Ares faction wide and 10% battle speed uh, for herself. Now, me at your peril. now uh, Hippolyta actually gains the same bonus. So both of them are daughters of Ares. Maybe they would add another Amazon uh, hero. Now it's interesting that she is supposedly in a hard starting position, but I really find that questionable. Anyway, let's begin. The past cannot be changed. Are we mere playthings of the gods? Or do we plead divine influence to justify our foolish choices? He's taken her! He's taken my wife! You've risked the safety of Troy. Troy is my home now. You have my oath, brother. She will be returned to you. Brother, I can fight! Go. Seek shelter. There'll be plenty of fighting ahead. The wrath of Akia will descend upon Troy. Paris acted in love. But he has incited war. Whether the walls of Ilios will endure, only the gods can tell. Alright, actually I was reading the Iliad and the Odyssey recently, and they held their amazing books. I don't think the game necessarily reflects them very well, Both but that's a different discussion. The scent of war is on the wind. Brother, your foolish passion has doomed us. Across the sea, the hateful Achaeans muster their armies, preparing to invade Troy. 
King Priam and his kin may aid your cause, for long ago oaths were exchanged between your warriors on the fields of Phrygia. To reach them, you must travel through the straits and cross the lands of the Thyni on the northern shores of Propontis. They dare forbid you passage, the fools. March west, for vengeance. Through glorious battle, I am redeemed! I mean, she was supposed to seek redemption for killing her sister, Hippolyta. So she accidentally killed her sister? War queen. Or it's questionable who exactly she killed, I but um, she fight. killed someone and was looking for redemption anyway. Show no so mercy. we are going to march to war here. It is better to fight this particular battle just to lower the casualties. So I have one unit of initiates, one unit of um, axemen, one unit of chargers, uh, slingers, javelins, and then cavalry. Now, based on the way they recruit units, the Amazons will have one major weakness as far as I can see it. They will not be able to easily recruit chariots. Now that is a problem because chariots are very 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 powerful. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I suppose that is true. What ability are we talking about? Discouraged by ability, that doesn't make sense. All right, so I'm going to take the slingers there from the back. Now I know I have the better army here. I'm going to use my skirmishers to hit these guys from the back side. Maybe I want to check the patch, uh, see what they might have changed uh, in it. Alright, these guys are already routing. Very, very good. We, live, we, fight. we die. Send them after there, and while the skirmishers will deal with the Kyrgyzian warriors. Go get them. Okay. going on here I think there's something wrong with them in guard stands maybe they changed it a bit could have been either way maybe it's a good idea to just uh, all 
All right, go get them. While the, yeah, while the uh, spearmen, spear women, whatever. Okay, so that army has been vanquished on the field of battle. Easily enough. Now I have choices. Obviously, I can let them live. Don't care about that. Glory in battle or replenishment. Now, generally, I would go with replenishment, but, but I want to kill them all. I survive and thrive. All right, that's good. Now... Over here, I am going to level her, so we get weapon damage or blood of Heracles. So that gives me 50% melee attack or 15% uh, for all allies. I'm going to go with that and I'm going to attack Cut this particular settlement or just put it under siege. We can take them. Okay. Now, when that's sorted out, I am just going to get copper saws for some extra wood. Let battle commence. This particular settlement will give me vision of the area. And I'll have to rely a lot on raiding uh, to get what I want. So I started a war with um, Athens, which is all very well and good, right? I believe our peoples are stronger together. Okay, I am going to ask for some wood. Actually, as much wood as I can uh, get Time from him. And a defensive the alliance right now. So well. He has some food. And that will do for no, the, the moment. Troy we'll will have bread. to wait. And then talk. Let us do more wood. Good. Beauty and bravery in one. What man can resist that? <laughs> Aren't you married, pray boy? Just something Sister. we're saying. Okay, with Paris, I'm actually going to get the military alliance. Because I could use that. With Hippolyta, I can't really gain anything. We might as well try. Now, they do still have more settlements. So I need, I'll need to deal with them. Some wine and figs first. Don't hold back.
Victory is ours! Back here. Oh, they had an army there. Okay, I don't need more units. I didn't realize that. I'll just encamp and get more units of my own. I'll probably need a full stack. So yeah, what I'm going to need to do right here is just wait for it, really. Okay, so... Uh, construct any buildings, but I need more population surplus to do that. Obviously, I could get uh, start getting spies soon enough. But yeah, that's just going to take... Resources. Some more chargers. And these guys are pretty... Well, right now I'm going to want javelins and initiates. Okay, now we'll do 14. blood some wine and figs first then we shall talk I am I hope you will the Amazon I am happy to listen to you The out. We might have. All right, so I'm just going to have to wait a couple of turns over here for uh, everything to take place here. I don't think they're going to charge out now. So it's going to take three turns until they start starving. I know I'm wasting time, but it's just. The reality of the situation over here. Could I win this? Uh, that's a bit of a tricky question, isn't it? 
I mean, they've got a bunch of militia warbands in the garrison. I mean, let's take a look at that garrison. So they've got three militia warbands, uh, one warrior unit, one Trojan warrior unit, or one archer unit, one slinger against my free. Question, could I win? I mean, the game says I would. I'm just gonna wait. Let battle commence. Might come to a quick end with this campaign, though, if I'm not. Like, the problem with playing back. horde armies, right, is just the fact. Right, so I'm going to. How much? Cut them okay, down. So I have four. Okay, what would it cost me to get an army? Indeed. Now, one of the things to say, though, is that, keep in mind, I cannot get reinforcements in battle from an adjacent army. But, crucially, I can use an adjacent army to build some units. I wonder if the AI is going to account for that, though, properly. Because I can't, Im can't imagine it's going to be easy, right? Alright, so I'm starting to run out of food. I still have some lumber. Alright, that's gonna take two turns. Immediately! Get moving! On the march! Alright, so this particular army. Show me blood! Okay. Now this particular army, so okay, this army cannot be reinforced. We can take them. Never defeated. Show no mercy. Glory through combat. Nope. So, so as a horde army, I'm off to a, a slow start. I could have just built more units, forced the siege, right? But now that decision was made poorly, since I didn't realize that well, they want a war. Then. Is it? All right, gonna wait one more turn, and lot. that will probably be the end. End of them, right? So because I have more gold than many of them do, they want a piece of that. Massacre them. Embrace your All right, doom. just thought to resolving this. I'm going to recruit some units here. Got a good amount of experience there. Good, some food. This will give me 150 battle glory. 100% administration efficiency. 10 gro horde growth. Okay. A bit more stone, a bit more wood. Destroy Crazy this place. I want the battle glory. War is my life. 
Right, and then I will. I live to fight on. Right, very well. How many points? Okay, she's got uh, three points. Still need a bit. So this would uh, give me a cost reduction on my axe units. Now it's important to note that I do have axe units that I can recruit. I guess the like the war bands are pretty decent. So what I'm going to do next turn once like I'm still going to recruit again. I wish I could recruit in a huh. Should I accept? How about no? So I will not accept that for right now. I'll just move on. See what I can get. Alright, good. So Royal Decree has been issued and I've gotten some extra wood. Now what I should get is gold. <laughs> Only 10 gold. Wow, that's uh, insignificant, isn't it? Since you asked nicely. Take the spoils. All right, so. Very well. Okay, so she can't recruit. Oh, yes, I will. Crap. I kind of messed that one up. I fear anyway, I will head over there. Gonna get more I'll axe units. Still need a bit more horde growth. Until I can afford that. How much? Okay, so I need stone and I have none. I have an issue, actually. Would that half our warriors fought so well. Would they indeed? I hope you will look to the future now. I'll trade them 200. Wait, actually. It's better if I just take the stone. Right, so I still need... Uh, let's say 10 gold. I think gold won't necessarily be an issue for the Amazons. Just an idea. Right, the reason I need that, however, is because I need this particular building. So this gives me 200, 200 experience to all units per turn. That's very important for the sake of experience. Um, six cord growth, right? So that's, that's going to improve things. She's actually going to get to three points. Now, the problem with Horde armies in Total War... Okay, so they would give me food for... That's a shit trade if I've seen one. No, piss off. I don't even need your resources. Oh, someone's under siege. That's a good question. Now, what would this give me? Now, I'm kind of curious there. All right, so we have... This particular army that's laying siege to them. Let's de uh, declare our support for the Trojans because the Amazons did fight on Troy's side. So this will give me 200 t food per turn. Uh, it's going to take her. Fair enough. Their treasures are ours. Their men Kay. doomed. Fine. Right, actually I could use that. For sure. Right, so I'm going to put I'll myself in that particular uh, position and I will like right now I can sustain this entire army actually, which is pretty important. Now, what I'm interested in is knowing whether or not this army will falter. Right, non-aggression pact. You want me to pay for a non-aggression pact? It's a pretty decent deal, all things considered. 
But yeah, I want to see what happens here before moving either west or south or east. I think I should conquer the entire east, conquer the entire Bosporus before doing anything else. See what these guys. This could work out well for us both. They only have two territories. Hold on a second. Okay. I may as well. Let battle commence. Right, so I actually want to go east. Alright, so the Trojan War has kicked off. Paris. Troy has declared war against Mycenae. Can you guys screw off? Alright, that's a an expected situation, I guess. So they've taken that settlement after I dealt with their army here at their cost. Well, Bethians, anyway, will be the next target. I live for the fight. Show me blood. All right, Argos. Oh, I'm just trampling around. This is really a bit, uh, let's just say, unrealistic. So, uh, some ranks gained. This was giving me 150 battle glory. Yeah, right now it's like raising kill. That's actually worth My doing. Is proven. She's gained a level, so we're gonna go for Ephira. Right, she's gained a level, so this would give her morale, and now she gains rage passively. Uh, I guess I may want to worship someone. The big question is who, so... This would give me melee attack 50%. <laughs> I think we know who we're going to be worshipping around here, aren't we? Kindle the sacred fires. That might be a bit of a problem if I start praying to him. But we will also gain a truckload of food by uh, taking silence, so prayer. And when I get the opportunity, I will also... Uh... Right, so this particular army has Blood Oath. Uh, blood unit summoned free, blood unit, blood sworn. Okay, War Spoils, whatever, Blood Elf, so I need a thousand, okay. Okay, I can actually get those units, I'll be able to get those units. Now, I feel the way about the Amazons as you would the Warriors of Chaos at one point, but with actually good roster. This is the important bit. So the Amazons have an actually good roster. They have cavalry, they have archery, and it's guess what's powerful, especially under the Warhammer fo formula, which is what this game is based on. Archers and cavalry, <laughs> basically. And the Amazons are the only faction that can actually recruit good cavalry. I mean, sure, you have the centaurs for everyone else, but I don't know. I feel like for creative assembly, this was the opportunity for them to finally make a faction down. where they could make it oh we can finally we can get the faction them. in the game that's all uh you know a female faction in total or it's like they've had that i guess you could say political desire for a while and it is a political thing mind you for them uh it's like Raising ideological i guess you could say it's like oh representation of women and gaming and all that crap Nothing now, I don't this. really give a shit about any of that, to be quite frank with you guys. Uh, so, this actually is a bit of a problem, and I'll explain why. So, on one hand, if you're playing the Amazons, chances are you're going to want to go Drill Expert, right? Pretty obvious reasons, because of the way your recruitment system works. Goes without saying. However... Well done. Uh, Having fresh units at the start of battle, even if you force march, is pretty important. Maybe not so important for the Amazons for some, you know, obvious reasons, right? Maybe it's not so important for them, but it is important 
um, in general. Now, it's not so important for Amazon. It's because the Amazons are more not quite, you know, they don't operate under the same principles as everyone. Now, these guys seem to be... Okay. So they're expanding across the territory of people that have conquered. This is, by the way, the issue of horde factions. Like, maybe raising a settlement should prevent a faction from resettling that region for at least, I don't know, 10 turns, something like that. I feel it's a bit of an issue. Don't hold back. Given everything. Alright, so here we're actually going to fight... Now, it seems that it's in a narrow corridor, but that's fine. Okay, let's... Uh... And I would probably advise most people, if they're planning to play an Amazonian faction, that they might be better suited to pick Hippolyta. Good reasons behind that. Okay, um, actually, I'll take three units of initiates there, two units there. I'll put all of the range units to support them and all the uh, X and yeah all the X units will go over there um, she's going to charge him like so we got these narrow choke points right that's actually these choke points though they're superb locations to to get some range units down like if you can see Right, so if they have nothing there, the cavalry will, will hold back. She's going to charge in Penistilia. Uh, she's going to charge in uh, over there. And the war bands are going to march over there. Maybe I should be fighting a lot more battles if they're fleeing so easily from, from my soldiers. Alright, Mully attack there. I'll send the cavalry there once the war bands have broken through. Penthesilea! Penthesilea, okay. So they're breaking through there from my initiates. Good. The combination, I feel, of of like range units and initiates is pretty deadly. Okay, so they're breaking here very, very easily. Ignore the fighting over there and keep charging onward. Their general is not important. The fight, the real struggle, though, seems to be here. But it's probably not going to last a long time. Do these units have fear or something? No. It's a bit weird, really. I probably need to check the balance changes, because, like, the enemy fling like this. Like, I know I've been playing on veteran before, but still breaking very very easily it's 
kind of weird I can't really deploy them on the ledge there. Doesn't why well, make sense as I see it. Hey. One of your units has no more ammunition. Sisters, attack! Go at them! Javelins to hands. We live, we fight. Fears and skills. We move. Advance! Victory is close enough to taste. has lost a victory point. Alright, their army here has been wiped out, their garrison as well. Let's see what we do with their sons and daughters. I'm thinking of that uh, Flash movie where he changes time, saves his, his mo a mom, and then uh, because of his actions, Aquaman and Wonder Woman team up and decide to conquer the world. and. Uh, Wonder Woman and then Wonder Woman and Aquaman end up fighting each other so Atlantis ends up fighting the Amazons and there's a scene between Wonder Woman and Aquaman and it's like he's asking uh, and she's demanding his surrender and it's like uh, and what what will you do with with us uh, will any of any of our sons live and she's like no not your sons but maybe your daughters basically so it's like kill the men keep the women right anyway so uh, this will give me bl battle glory, but obviously less resources. This would actually give me quite a bit of resources that I do need right now. War Queen. On the move. Amazon power. Right away.
So what are you after? Victory is ours! The Amazons are very welcome. That will never work. Don't hold back. This is it. All right, so they're going to starve in two, uh, two turns. Which is pretty decent. <laughs> Not interested in a peace treaty right now. You know what? I think I'll just take territory near Hector and let him basically take it. Since he is my ally at the end of the day. Let battle commence! Kill the lot! I mean, I'm sure I could win that battle here. Undeniably so. I need more wood. I think I'll go for stone. So they actually gain less resources. I can't. I doubt. Looks like a waste of time to me. Who are they at war with? Me. Screw it. Not worth fighting them on my own. Especially not now, anyway. And what can... The Amazons may speak. I may or may not listen. I am sure we will both come out of this better off. We could. This is a good time to talk. I have no problem hearing you out. 
I will try. Yeah. So. them down. We can take them. Embrace your doom. Show no mercy. This is it. I'm going to take the walls here. Why not? I doubt this... Kill the lot! Massacre them! Destroy this place! Death or glory! Right, I'm going to need to get a spy though. So for that, I'm going to have to destroy some buildings. Well, they may want a piece. They're not gonna get it. Or they're demanding a piece, and I, they demand I pay up as well. Right, so what's the. Let's see what the missions are, right? There is a, a mission to do here.
Well, I think I'm gonna need to pick a pack, uh, faction here to... to side with in the boss purse. I wanna clean up this entire area before moving south. down all right let battle commence all right to build Ares war cult yeah so gonna need that first we can take them show me blood Embrace your doom. Show no mercy. Don't hold back. We can take them. Show me blood. All right, this settlement by the looks of it is going to give me a decent amount Kill of gold. Them. Then we have these other settlements. We might as well try. We can both behave like reasonable people. Let's see if they even accept, agree to me joining their war. Yeah, they would. All right, first things first, though. I want to deal with the nuisances that I already have and then move on. Kind of losing a bit of food, but that's fine. This I do have a lot it. of resources at the moment. Okay, so she would get recruitment cost come from raising. Let's go with that. From war spoils. Let's go with resources. I'd say that's a pretty decent path. Uh, Yeah, these units can be upgraded, but I don't have the billing for it. I need six surplus over there. And I also probably need to get another army to be able to uh, uh, to get some benefits there. Okay. Just a moment though. Actually gonna... Okay. I'm going to end the turn over here, bleed them out a bit more, and core, and then we'll see. Where is their army though? What happened to their army? Might be in that uh, settlement there. 
Oh, so they have this one. They might have taken this particular settlement. Anyway, let's see if we can make a deal with Dardania. Don't hold back. Okay, so this Embrace is over right doom. now. The thing is, as... Like, on one hand, I have to be cautious if I'm playing her. So I can't really be as aggressive as I may have wanted. That's a lot of resources there. Holy crap. I fear no man. I live to fight on. Okay. Uh, so here, the resources have been gained. That's not an issue. I want to get this level four. But if I do that, then obviously I'm going to lose the perfect some benefits. Warrior. Now here I feel like I want to get, like if I look, I, I want to get some like melee axes, at least some of them. Now in terms, I would also want to pick up uh, ranged units, right? So I would want to get an army of ranged units. Death bring us. The issue is actually going to be food, believe it or not. I mean, wood is never going to be a problem because no units cost wood. Go on. What? We might. Okay. We. Some. I'm. It's a pleasure to speak with the Amazons. So they've got the non-aggression deal with Hector. Ask for a bunch. Yes. I'm willing to hear what the Amazons are. Okay. I am happy. We are not. Don't. The Amazons. Right. The Amazons' reputation precedes them. Well, let's talk. And my sisters. War is my life. All right, so I'm not going to have the incredible overpowered javelins, but I will have javelin chariots. So my javelin men will basically be my charioteers. My slingers will become archers or heavy slingers. Okay, shielded slingers. And this is a bit of an interesting tech tree, though. Keep in mind, it does depend as well on what you're uh, going to go for. Amazon power. I can also get some sirens. Uh, so, I can't see. Let's uh, head over there. I live for the fight. Just gonna put her in. I'll deal with it. Yeah, that makes sense. Since you ask nicely. Should I upgrade that? Well, that would be one, and all it would give me is fifty experience. For recruitment. Okay. Eventually, obviously, I'll want to get this because, well, there's no point in having so many buildings. And I think, like, when I, I, when I look at it, I really think that I am going to need the second horde just following the main one. Two powerful armies capable of fighting their own battles. Uh, lightning strike would be nice here. <laughs> Why in the world would I accept that when I've got you by the throat, boys? Why oh why? Okay, Asia has declared war against Paris. It's not enough that the West has declared war against Paris. All of Asia is coming against them. Though Asia means something different in this game, but still. It is interesting to think about the idea of the name Asia, because if you look at it from a historical perspective, it 
It means a whole bunch of things, right? Or it can mean a whole bunch of things. Someone failed. So wait, where is their army? I will try to find time. That's a serious question. Where the hell is their army? I haven't fought anyone really. No armies, nothing. Death finds us all. Yes, I will. I am sure we will both come out. I've consulted the omens. The gods bless our meeting. Commence. Show no mercy. Don't hold back. Show me blood. All right. So I'm going to get some extra units. Whether or not that's enough to win the battle is a bit unclear to me. But we'll see. It is a pretty large battlefield. So that might be enough. The Axemen will go... Axewomen, whatever. Uh, will go on that side. My heaviest spears will go down this particular path. The weaker one, supported by my Axeman, Axewoman, will go there and I'll split uh, my chargers between these two. As well as my range units. And my hero will go, well, wherever is the small opportunity. Yeah, she'll go kill their hero there. Destroyers of men, conquerors of empires, bringers of ruin. Any other special title you want?
Your hero is under attack. So pathetic. We live, we fight. Difference breeds strength. A match for any man. Death calls. And one fears and skill. Chaplin. Forward Strike hard. Eye of your death. All right. Enemies beware. So the front line there is still holding on their side. But for the rest of them, we basically forced them out. Cavalry incoming. Obviously, they still will have quite a few units defending their uh, control point. Hero has sustained a wound. Ooh, that is a lot of units. Now it's my hope, my genuine hope, that they'll probably is close enough to taste break by the time I actually get there. Because I don't necessarily I'm fond of the idea of having to march all the way there just to get a lot of my own units killed. Just an idea. these guys if she can get lightning strike she's probably the strongest hero in a battle in the entire game if she gets blood sworn units in a in a battle Because you can summon so many Bloodsworn units.
All right, so they got those. Gonna fall back there. Alright, the Bloodsworn War Bands marching in. Your warriors are losing heart. Get out of Not good. I'm getting shot to pieces by their archers. Have been and my cavalry needs to get out of there. Alright, Bloodsworn units coming in. Cavalry getting out of there before they get shot to pieces. Warband moving in. Your warriors are rallying. Alright, so the settlement's taken and their army is annihilated.
owes me meet Hades. Amazon power! We shed blood to appease the gods. Hear my prayer. Erebus shroud my steps. They'll believe their leaders are incompetent. Yes, I will. Don't hold back. We can take them. Glory through combat. As you say. I hope you do not... I did not... I am. We will break... Rick up. We... <laughs> I will not be... The subtle blade. Well, I'm gonna get the Minotaur. That's what's gonna happen. Cut them down. So be it. Because taking the settlement will improve my favor with Ares to such a degree that he will give me a Minotaur. All right, so Dardania has advanced. Nope. They stand no chance. So yeah, 600 favor with Ares. And I can recruit a bunch of giant units, which probably are better than many of my own current units. Okay. Massacre them! We will break bread, and then...
Don't make me regret listening to you. Any warrior who fights with honor has my ear. Indeed. With that half hour worry. I believe our peoples are stronger together. We will break bread. Ready for action. Off we go. Immediately. This is it. I'm sure I can find new recruits. Show no mercy. me blood raise it and enslave their men folk war queen Not all companions of it. All woman, all warrior. Will do. Death bring her. I live to fight on. I'll do it. Go on. How may I help my sister in arms? Well, she's marched against Greece, which is good. Very, very good. Now, I can spend one point over here, but I think I'll wait. I will wait and instead march uh, north to take back these lands of the Bosporus. Wipe these guys out. I think that's a pretty reasonable plan. All things considered. Right. 
Right, so I'll just wipe them out. See what kind of uh, battles, what kind of challenges they can provide. Well, also working on... Uh, well, I, I'll need growth, actually. So I'll need to wait quite a lot of turns, actually, for that second horde to grow. So you can get a second horde, but the growth rate is so slow. We need to move it. No, 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 no. I don't want to... The growth rate is so slow that it's actually pretty much not worth it. Acceptable. Yeah, and slowly but surely, I am losing here. Now, <laughs> here's the fun fact. If I wanted to, right, if I wanted to, I can get a powerful army here, if I so desire. The, <laughs> actually, yeah, so I think I'll trade away. I can't. I'll trade away some of the gains. Well, Hector has nothing. Troy has a I lot. I am pleased the Amazons wish to speak. All right, so barter agreement, I'll give them, let's say, 100 stone for 250. No, wait, he doesn't have anything. Uh, next turn, let's say five as well. Okay. So he has no Paris as. I'm sure we will both profit from this exchange. Okay. Well, I mean, if he's gonna give it for it to me for free. All right. I'm ready to talk. I am not going to trade any of that, but No, hold on. I am happy. Sister, it is a joy to see you. Indeed. What the hell, sister? <laughs> this so she's going to give me some resources the there. Amazon I'm ready to talk. It's a pleasure to speak with the Amazons. I'll honor that request. Leaving now! Not all companions of Ares are men. Consider yourself. Women of honor. Won't work. Of course. 
course. Man killer. One less obstacle. Discretion guaranteed. The mad. I am pleased. We will break bread and then talk. I hope you will look to the future now. All right, so Achilles has declared the war on Troy now. And uh, my main army has... Oh, finally, Hippolyta, you see reason. Even pay me for the privilege of allying with you. All right, so all of this territory is going to remain open. I expect Hector or Aeneas would, will eventually take it. And it's interesting, we think of the Trojan War as this this epic conflict, right? When in reality, it's probably that the entirety of the Trojan War, well, though significant, don't get me wrong, uh, likely, I mean, you're thinking about Troy, you're thinking about probably, you know, western part of Anatolia. And, and obviously the... You're out of luck. The... So that's going to work. Good. Get them there. We'll get the her here. So I'm losing food every turn, right? And that it's is a problem. They won't know what to believe. I have not served you well. No, you have not served me well at all. The important thing, though, I'd say here is that what I'm going to do is I'm going to get an army of giants <laughs> and then probably initiate. Maintaining two armies, though, will be interesting. Let's call it that. I see little. But I actually do. Any warrior? We. They're not going to accept that. Should be. So yeah, we need to gain vein vengeance over there. Don't. Very well. So an army of giants with maybe sirens should be able to win the day, right? Carry the day forward. Should be significant enough to win. To pull through against their uh, their defenses. Well, in the east and the north. I will uh, wipe these guys out. It would be fairly tricky. And that's actually good. So these guys, because they're at war with one another, that agent action actually will help me out there. Very nice. Okay. She's leveled up. Good.
I may as well. Let battle commence. Embrace your doom. Destroy this place. Amazon warrior. Massacre them! Since you ask nicely. through combat get into position I'll make it happen I understand Yes, I will. We can take them! Naturally, to the oars. I'll stop at nothing. A match for any man. <laughs> Living free. I don't think so. We've docked. Blade can avert a war. Cut them down. Whoa! 
Flatten it! I survive and thrive. I'll deal with it. Victory is ours! I can be. Allow me to assist. War is my trade. All right, let's see what's going to happen now. Hmm. All right, she's got a bunch of archers over there. So the Amazon's uh, High Palata has taken the territory there. Never defeated. As you say. Raise anchor! Understood. Glorious death awaits. We could both profit from... I'm ready to talk. I'm sure. We have much to... I would like to hear what... I've consulted the omens. The gods bless our meeting. I've consulted the omens. The gods bless our meeting. All right, that won't quite solve my food issues, but it all will... Uh... Significantly reduce them. Alright, so he's moving over there with his armies. There is Hector going to one army across the sea, two armies across the sea. Paris is also across the sea there. Another army marching there. 
it would be pretty nasty to lose all these giant units, but maintaining them can be... I mean, I need someone with a lot of food to basically give me... Alright, so Paris is marching there against, like, Amides. Alright, so she's, uh, pulling back from across the sea there. I should start worshipping Zeus, maybe. Would work out, right? Oof. Okay, so... So I need to take those to settlements. And I do have a fierce battle ahead of me. Still. That is unreasonable. That's so ridiculously unreasonable. We'll show the world. Make them suffer. Get them. Slaughter them. Go all out. Show no mercy. War is my life. Kill the lot. Show me the right, that will give me a decisive victory. Raise it and enslave their men folk. Vengeance on all. I'll see to it. Okay, uh... I may as well. <laughs> yeah, you may as well. Bloody. Okay. Income from... That would cost two, and I have four. Let's see what else I can get for her. Damage on that. I mean, it's actually fine because then I can get another Since unit. You ask nicely. I ask so very politely, don't I? Okay, boys and girls. I need the camera up again. Don't hold back. Yeah. So Penistelia is the one that actually is uh Victory awaits. Is good than a siege. Right, so this one would give me two hundred and thirty battle glory. How much do they have? Into battle. It would be nice to be able to get some battle glory there. Uh speaking about battle glory. Right. I don't quite have... Right, so Blood of uh, Vengeance. Like That's what I would get for 1800 Battle Glory. I'm almost there, but not quite. And it's going to take a couple of turns. I Look, I feel like if it's a... Uh, if... If it ends up being a battle on uh, the open field, where is Dardania? There we go. I am sure we will both come out of this better off. I am sure we will. 
No, shut the fuck up and get your ass here, pretty I boy. Hope you will look to the I need I... aid. <laughs> Not all. Alright, so my cy uh, Cyclops army, well, my nope. Cyclops, my uh, right army up. there is doing its job. That's Salman. Here's what I will do. Since I'm actually not in a hurry here, I mean, I'll just move her right inside the territory and then. Uh, I hope you do. Then start doing some raiding, actually. Need some resources. Food, as always, is the biggest consumer. Now, of course, I would win this, but it's kind of interesting. Um, should I fight this one? Because it's an interesting situation. Like, I'm pretty certain if push comes to shove, I would be able to win that particular battle, right? Like, if I really look at it and think about it, it's like, wait, what do they have? It's like, oh, they have a couple of spearmen. I have both Hera and I have... Uh, Right, so I'll just wait one turn until the siege ram is built. Then I'll attack the city. Like the the reason I care about this, it's like, oh yeah, a hundred food. Woohoo! What a surprise. The important thing is that it would give me a lot of honor with the Fina though. Which in turn gives me a <laughs> What would a Gorgon? do for me it's like oh yeah you can worship Athena she'll give you resources I'm like okay uh can I simply inquire what would a Gorgon well to be I fair a Gorgon is more of an offensive unit anyway please tell me that I wouldn't get a satyr from Apollo though because that's just like stupid no that's uh Aphrodite yeah uh, so yeah, Aphrodite would still give me that crap. All right, all right. And this would give me, that's a sweet, 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 sweet amount of. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, here's what's gonna happen. And I'll put it plainly. So the army in the West will take out that territory. Oh, damn you all. Bollocks. We will break bread. And then talk. You know what? Hector boy. We could both come out of this better off. How about you wipe them out? I mean, I know you have an army there. Aeneas of God. Not all companions of Ares are men. Consider yourself welcome. Without... Yeah, that'll do. Well, 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 well. Achilles just got wiped the fuck out. <laughs> All right, that's fun. And Hector withstood his... Actually, Hector didn't really lose anyone. Hmm, interesting. So Hector has beaten back Achilles and is about to begin his own invasion. And we got that uh, priestess moving in. That was interesting. Actually, hold on a second. I'm just going to put these too high. Yeah. Screw the strategy. I want to see what's going on on the map. All right, so you're moving there, spy. Oof, Sparta. Is Sparta gonna lay siege to the Amazon forces there? Maybe. Okay, hold on. No. All right, so Paris. Okay, she wants to give me some wood in exchange for bronze. I'm like, nope. 
And by the way, never trade. I mean, food. Mm, factions will give you a lot of food. Oh, we got another army courtesy of Fia marching against us. But uh, Paris is marching himself against Fia, which is a problem, going to be a problem for Achilles. Yeah, no. I'm not trading resources one to one, especially since bronze is pretty damn useful in its own right. Okay. Right, so. She gets to move. Very well. Heading out. Over here and start raiding. Their treasures are ours. Their men doomed. How much would it require? Okay. So it requires 50% move. movement? Okay, good. Take Any warrior who fight. That's beyond me. Cut them down. Alright, several suffer. more turns there. Now I'm gonna put my faith in my giants. Because I'm pretty certain they'll prevail here. To be quite honest about it. I think that they are quite capable of breaking down these walls on their own. The issue isn't gonna be the walls though, is it? No. So, yeah, I mean, this This is an interesting settlement, isn't it? If I attacked from here, that would be a disaster. So, realistically, I only really have one choice. Your warriors are losing heart. Freedom. Interesting. Rollock crushers. All right, here come the giants. Here. In these kind of tight quarters, there are go they are going to be very, very, very big. And my other initiate unit will uh, take the walls against the uh, javelins. Your warriors are attacking the gates. Ladders have a foothold on their walls. Aggression! I 
You have captured the gates. Break some heads! Joyous! The pink is looming! Enemies beware! Prepare to die! Save your breath! I know That's my right. tactics! Ruthless aggression! Your warriors are rallying! Joyous! Captured the enemy tower. Fierce and skilled! And them! Your future Sirens. lies in Hades! Dyer's brood! Joyous! I Master Great! Insults are no substitute for a better Sons of Titans! Mangalators! Break some heads! Off to war! Coming through! Let's go! One of your units has no more ammunition. Where's the battle? The foe has captured your tower. Your warriors have been routed. Giants! This is your last chance to run away. Bone snappers! Disengage! Widow makers! Grolic crushers! I know Red my tactics! Giants! By Ares, your warriors are rallying. Well, maybe they rebalanced the Giants, or maybe I expected too much from them. I thought they were gonna do better. The enemy have captured the gates. But apparently I was wrong. Alright. Just gonna reload that save and continue the siege then. Since apparently a winning winning here is not gonna happen. Try again. No, I'm not gonna try again. What I'm going to do is just wait. They don't have an army to relieve the siege. That's their problem. Well, they might have one. Into battle. They might have a second army that they're building right now, but it's going to take time. War queen. 
So yeah, I'm just gonna put this uh, settlement under siege. This will give me some favor with the gods. So what is Sparta doing? The war continues now. No reinforcements. Feelings pay off. Embrace your doom. Massacre them. Show no mercy. Fear us. Don't hold back. So what? This is it. Cut them down. Let battle commence. Kill the sacrificial bull. Show mercy, divine ones. We can take them.
All right, next turn, I guess I'll have to decide whether or not I keep uh, the siege or just abandon it. Because there is an army heading for from the south, and I need to see if they're going to try and relieve that siege. Because if they are, that's a big, big, big problem. Kill the lot! Show me blood! Don't hold back! An enormous issue. Of course we can speak. Okay. Right, I feel like uh, Frace will be an ally. Don't make me regret listening to you. Well... That's going to solve a lot of issues. I actually need the food. Why not? I d Look Break it. I, I hope you will look to the future now. All right, there Gardenia. is much to discuss. It would please me to speak with you. That's correct. I'll, uh... This... I think winning as uh, the Amazons is going to be pretty easy. I mean, you need to take Athens, which no one gives a shit, which isn't going to survive, really, since the Greeks aren't going to start the war with Athens. And if the Greeks don't start the war with Athens, uh, well, this kind of stuff can happen. And does happen. Now, the Amazons obviously can only confederate with one another. Okay. Let's see what happens. My skills are acknowledged.
massacre them. We can take them. Flatten it. Yes, I earned this. Well done, my sisters. I'll do it. Get them! Cut them down! Victory awaits! Turn from this path. Make them suffer! Don't hold back! Yes, I will. My fate is to question. Always question. Will you listen to my wisdom? Cut them down! Let battle commence! Go all out!
This could work out well for us both. I would... Alright, so their turn. Fia is still got some tricks. They're gonna break... Uh, well, they're actually not quite capable of breaking uh, Hector. So I feel like Hector is just going to be doing the... He's going to show up. Right. So he's got an army there. He's got various armies, actually. He may not have enough units to destroy Fia. But he has enough units to make life miserable for Achilles over there. Meanwhile... We do have the question of Sparta. But unfortunately for them... Oh, Achilles has shown up. So Achilles still has an army over there. Okay. Destroyer of men. This is it. Destroy this place. Death or glory. Show no mercy. Destroy everything. We'll show the world. It would please me. I am sure we will both come out of this better off. Without... Dry. 
drives me. I'll deal with it. The Amazons are very welcome. It would please me to speak with you. So Dardania has taken that, good. And now I just, uh, well, just need to march west. There are settlements and factions to deal with over there, but I've established a stronghold here. I guess I um, should use the gold and battle honor that I've accrued to uh, get uh, better units. As reinforcements. It's an interesting concept, by the way. The way the Horde army works, right? And it's absolutely aimed at the Warriors of Chaos. So it's like, hey, you can't really get reinforcements. Not that there's a Horde army. You have another Horde uh, nearby to support you all the time. But instead, what you can do is um, get extra units in battle. A lot, potentially. And these units could, like, imagine playing as, I don't know, Archeon and just getting, like, three extra Karas warriors, warrior units against the Empire, and then they eventually get upgraded to Chosen as just an idea. We'll see, though, what they do with Warhammer. No, I think I'm reaching... Why would you end that? I think I'm reaching a point of total war. It's like probably not gonna play it anymore on the channel. The interest just isn't there. Okay, Corinthians, or it might just be this particular game, right? Because. I mean, in a sense, like the Iliad and all that, very popular. This game, however, it's not popular, I think. The material world needed. What can I do for the Amazons? Get ready to march. Okay, so research complete over there. Construction of temple building, construction of all military buildings. Um, let's get that since I do have enough resources. No time to rest. Why not, though? Bad idea. So yeah, she's gonna take this. Uh, the second army. All right. Yeah, and then I'll unite the hordes and basically lay siege here. Oh, maybe I should. I'll stop at nothing. Alright, so he's gonna 
get dismissed from that sort. Thea, uh, from that uh, uh, army. So I need to send someone to Troy. Then we'll see what. Okay, so Hector is one there. He's also got another stack of units heading over to, to aid the situation over there. He isn't going to be able to take, like, he's pulling back his army to replenish and try maybe get that stack to full. Paris has moved Helen there. Oh my. That's bold. Mind you, losing Helen isn't actually bad for Paris because he actually gains a significant bonus when he does that. Though, keep in mind, Helen is a negative. Losing Helen is overall probably a negative because Helen herself also uh, has, like, okay, so Paris has his own army bonuses, right? Helen has a faction wide bonus. So losing that is probably a huge negative in the, at the end of the day. Though it does make Paris' army significantly more powerful. Alright, so Hippolyta. They're. So they're waging a f war over here against the uh, Anatolian Achaeans. So she's gonna lay siege to this particular settlement and wipe it off the face of the earth and steal all their bloody resources. Are you kidding me? Suicide. That's what that is, I'll tell you that much. That's what that is. They've decided to commit uh, suicide against Troy. I'm not even gonna have to fight them, really. It's gonna be Troy that ends up fighting them. So the Boeotians, okay. I don't wonder how exactly the Amazons end up conquering, because I've seen this happen a lot in my campaigns, right? War is my life. Whereby... Whereby the Amazons end up taking... Glory through combat! Victory awaits! <laughs> Raise the place! War is my trade. Indeed. We might as well try. The Amazons are... We could both profit.
Go on. We'll carry on. Leave it to me. Cut them down. You're our slave now. Living free. No time to rest. Not yet. You're being hasty. My motives are my own. New course. It would please me to speak with you. I would like to hear what the Amazon... The Amazons are sure to bring an interesting perspective. The man who sways your heart would be privileged indeed. May your visit fulfill both our hopes. All right, so I'll uh, head to Troy, see what what I can get there, and then keep moving. So apparently I did something that was dishonorable. I have no idea what it was. Getting a war declared on me. Oh, because the damn non-aggression pact. That's what it was. Those two factions, wasn't it? <laughs> so they declare war on me with their ally. And I'm somehow the one that loses reputation here. Even though I'm not the one... Woman, 
Don't hold back. Raise it and enslave their menfolk. I fear nothing. Vengeance. The Amazons rise. Serving our queen. The Amazon. Yes, we should talk. So what are you after? I've consulted the omens. The gods bless our meeting. Right, so he'll uh, he'll go to war against them. And you know what? Maybe it would be best if I got the war between Frace and uh, Dardania going. I can certainly engineer one. Sure, I'll take that. I don't actually have to do anything. There is a battle ahead there. But I want our chariots. And I'll get them, just now. Man killer! Yes. Death bringer. Embrace your doom. Show me blood. I am pleased the Amazons wish to speak.
Take them! Flatten it! I survive and thrive! Glorious death awaits! Too sick to hold a sword. My skills are yours. A well-placed blade can avert a war. I may as well. I live to fight on. Well, I have to take that particular settlement, but we'll see how it all ends. Alright, so Dardania has taken this particular port. I'll unite my armies, and although I won't be able to bring them both to bear in single battle, that's not really what's important. Also, I'll gladly destroy these two settlements. How much food would that give me? Probably quite a bit, wouldn't it? We'll figure that out. Please tell me they have not recolonized one of those settlements. I'd rather not deal with that. Well, apparently they man. have. We've docked. You may find their greed will be their downfall. The helping hand of fate. Okay. I'll see to it. Embrace your doom. Show me blood. Good. All right, just going to take this particular cell. Time to fight. So let's bring the Amazonian army against them. Axes behind. Yeah, chariots will charge on that open field. They'll do pretty good there. Yeah, like hell.
Damn it, though. Go, go, go. Your hero is under attack. You won't help us here. Your words mean nothing. Divine vengeance. Oh, so they've re they've <laughs> removed the ridiculous nonsensical kill counts on chariots. Yeah, that's good. They're just another unit now. Powerful one, capable of disrupting formations pretty easily, but. And playing an important role in battles, but not the kind of unit that gets hundreds of kills in a single battle in seconds. Victory is close enough to taste. One of you units has gone berserk. Home. 
All right, their main field army is annihilated. Victory. On the march, the perfect Amazon warrior. You may find my dubious skills of use. Woman, all warrior. I'm not looking. Well, too bad that you're not looking for a fight because I most certainly am. Can you see? All right, they're marching an entire army there. That should be sufficient, I hope. Yes, we should talk. All right, Costine signing out. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and enable notifications, really. Click that bell icon so that you're aware when I'm uh, uploading or streaming new content.